Welcome back into the Talking Fitchburg. That was Tony's kid on there right there. <laughs> yeah. But but a new daddy, apparently. <laughs> yeah. Uh, this segment is uh, our guest segment, and it's Tony King from the Recreations Department, uh, who always brings the uh, fun in activity. I do. I do. And we have a lot of activities coming up. Uh, in particular, ones I want to get a little information out about are basketball. It seems like a far away away, but it's here where registration started because the flag football season's already started. That's been going uh, on for a little bit. Well, practices have, and then games start this Saturday. Do you get enough referees yet? Well, good question. I'm glad you brought that up. All right, let's skip ahead Sorry, to that. I just, no uh, problem. I just cut right into the chase. That's okay. We, we actually, uh, promoted it on this show. Right, right. And we're, we're actually trying to help still you. looking for a couple referees if anybody's interested. Um, the best way to let us know if you're interested is just email me, call me. I believe my name and number might be somewhere down here. <laughs> right? No? No? It will no. be coming. Don't worry. All right, all right. There it is. Oh, uh, uh, there. If you just want to email me, give me a call. Uh, we'll I feel you, the ratings going we'll down. Get you signed up. <laughs> but yes, we could oh. definitely use some more officials. But back to the back to basketball. So we have basketball for uh, grades first all the way up to eighth grade. Uh, so a lot of basketball going on this year. Uh, and this year, what's cool is from third grade and up, it's all traveling leagues. So it's like big time now. You're you're it's playing big. Verona, Wanakee. Monona, Mount Horeb. You guys all have all teamed up? Wow. Yeah, it's been a lot of work, but uh, we got quite the league going. And then at the end of the year, we have a really fun tournament, end of the year tournament that we do. So a <laughs> lot of uh, collaboration going on. So it should make for a really fun year. Um, we also, speaking of NFL referees, we could use some basketball officials. Gotcha. Man. So uh, what we actually are doing this year, we're offering a, an officiating clinic, and that's coming up on October 8th. It's for ages 15 and up, uh, and it's an all-day clinic. Basically, you'll start in the morning learning the basic rules of the games. Then we'll have a lunch. Then after that, we're actually bringing out some of our teams, and you're going to actually practice officiating real games, real real live time. So the kids are allowed to, like, commit every foul that's possible? They can just go, it can be... <laughs> That's crazy. the best way you oh, learn. You got EMTs it's be on standby. The too. roughest, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> roughest blood rec game yeah. ever. Yeah. yeah, it's gonna be. Awesome. We'll need those for game of the weeks then for sure. Oh, oh yeah, man. we'll get those. Uh, <laughs> so, so yeah, if you're interested in that, that's on our website. Just uh, check it out. Sign up there. Um, and then what else we got going on? Oh, speaking of what's about to get started, uh, soccer is about to start next week. So if anybody's still interested in getting registered for that, we have first grade, kindergarten, first grade, and second and third grade soccer. So Season's almost here. Wow. Um, it's all happening. Now with the summer closed. Oh, did you guys mention that the splash pad is officially closed now? Uh, we didn't. Okay. It is now we closed. Should have. It's even though it's gonna be like ninety degrees today and the perfect day to be out the splash pad, we it's have done. shut it down for the season, yeah. Yeah. So it's a sad, sad bummer. Thing. But that's about it for the recreation stuff going on. If you want to find out more information. We already did that. Oh, there it is. Right there. Yep, that's where we want to go. Check that out. Yep. Now, speaking of other things, recreation and my personal recreation. <laughs> that's why we <laughs> save it for the end now, because you can trim it off at you know at the, right. the ends out here, right? <laughs> so Saturday, mm -hmm. I made it to the game. Awesome game. We we, uh, we started off our show with oh. us with these headlines here. Oh my god, it was gosh. phenomenal. It was so much fun. And so I'm tailgating out there before the game, as you do, and I happen to see two very tall gentlemen, and I'm like, whoa. Well, I got to go say hi to these guys. I knew who they are. Mm -hmm. So I went and talked to them, got a picture. We got Devin Harris and Brian Butch. <laughs> <laughs> nice. And goofy Tony in the middle. I don't know where Devin was looking. I think he was just trying to avoid me and stay as far away as he, from me as he could. But, uh, yeah, it was pretty cool to see those two guys up there. You look very did, uh, small next did to Did you, like, <laughs> yeah, he's oh huge. Oh, gosh. <laughs> you just run and chase him down? I have pretty much. I think I went up to him and kind of, like, tickled hey. their backs. And I'm like, hey, guys. <laughs> <laughs> they were really creeped out at first. But then I made it okay to wow. smooth them over a little That's bit. That's pretty cool. So, yeah, That's it was cool. fun. It was a blast. And the fan, LSU fans were so much fun. That's what uh, I heard. I oh. heard, all the, you know, there's always going to be some rough ones out there, both right. sides, certainly. Yeah. But I heard overall that, uh, you know, it sounded like a fun I saw a lot of different uh, foods. Like oh, yeah. that sounded like you know would be a, kind of a treat to walk around the tailgates and. Yeah, I wanted to find some crawfish. Unfortunately, I did not find any. But oh, you should have um, brought some up. You know, well, some frozen yeah, stuff from oh, Wisconsin, oh, right? Oh, <laughs> not good. Not good. <laughs> I have done it before. We actually did it one Thanksgiving. Not good. I'm real bad. Yeah. But it was a lot of fun. Fans were awesome. 
uh, and I hope they do more games at Lambeau because the college Me atmosphere too. is really cool. Yeah, I. I it was lo- like I could tell from just watching. Like it was loud that was the me. whole time. That was you. No, that, that was, was yeah. I single-handedly got that all going. Me Did too. you? Oh, I'm surprised I have a voice today. I nonstop. Wow. Yeah, wow. it was a blast. Um, so yeah, now I'm looking forward to a regular season. I kind of called the regular. That was kind of a special championship game. Now it's like Akron, and who, yeah. who's up after hold that? On, hold on. I do have this here. Yeah. So you got Akron. They got uh, Georgia State. Yes. Oh. <laughs> Juggernaut, <laughs> juggernaut, yeah, yeah. So I mean, now now it's like six weeks before we have another like big game, which is a little unfortunate. But Packers, they're coming. How about that Josh Sitton thing? That was weird. That's still uh, still tough to I don't tough to understand. Yeah, I'm I'm a little surprised by that, but we'll see what happens. Maybe you know Ted knows what he's doing. He's a man. He is. All right, Tony. Thank you so much for being on the show. Thank you. We'll catch you for up. Having me. Catch up with you next month. Ay, ay, ay. I'll take a quick break. Wrap it up. PBJ. PBJ. Next. Talk to Pittsburgh.